really happy with how the whole process worked. Uh, fantastic to have so many nominations come through from very worthy charities and we're hoping that the charities got some good exposure uh, from the process regardless of whether they've won or not. Uh, fantastic to have had so many uh, people vote throughout the voting process. Uh, to have three and a half thousand votes or close to it is a, a fantastic result. And yeah, as you say, the, the work starts now and that really begins today with our first meeting with T and the girls uh, to, to come up with a plan for how we're gonna make the most out of this day and uh, give them a great opportunity to, to carry Kate's legacy forward. So uh, aside from the $200 entry fee that each player will, will pay on the day, uh, we've got some good ideas already about how we can hopefully raise a little bit more money. So we'll have some silent auctions and some live auctions. We'll come up with some creative way to, um, for people to be able to donate some more money when they're out on the golf course playing. And uh, while entries initially are only open to our members, uh, if, if we don't fill the field with our members, then there'll be opportunities for the, for the public to be able to enter the tournament too at that same $200 entry fee. So we're really excited about the next couple of weeks, working hard with T and the girls, uh, and, and looking forward to, to raising a lot of money and doing something really good for the community.